Hey guys, Mark McKillier here with LiveAnabolic.com. And today, I want to answer a question for you guys that I hear all the time, and that is, can you get ripped just using resistance bands? Well, I'm not going to make you wait until the end of the video to tell you the answer. Right up front, of course, the answer is yes. And let me explain why. First of all, I want to start by discussing why resistance training is so important, especially as we get older. Guys, I'm 57. So once you're in your 40s, guys, I think resistance training is far more important than doing cardio. And let me tell you why. First of all, as we get older, our testosterone levels just start to naturally decline. And I've shot several videos about that. You really need to go check those out. And why do we care if our testosterone starts to decline as we get older? Well, guess what? Testosterone is the critical hormone that regulates how much muscle we can put on and also how well our body metabolizes fat as a source of energy. So guess what? Low testosterone means less muscle, more fat. It also means that we're going to have lower libido, on and on and on. Man, that hurts our focus, our energy levels. So resistance training helps to negate the natural aging process and the natural decline of testosterone as we get older. All right, so that is critical, guys. You have to understand that first. Now, I'm gonna go back and answer the second question is, you know, how do we get ripped? Can we get ripped using resistance bands? Well, guess what? Resistance training is just a fancy way of saying, putting a stress or a load on your muscle. Well, guess what? We can put a load on our muscle using a band, a dumbbell, a barbell, or if you go to the gym, all kinds of fancy equipment. And that thing you need to know is your muscle, it doesn't know what's creating the force, okay, or the load that it's trying to lift. It just knows that it's under stress. So your muscles don't care whether it's resistance bands that is causing the stress on that muscle or a dumbbell or some equipment at a big fancy gym. So guess what? That is the reason why we can get ripped using resistance bands. And another thing, guys, is resistance bands are just dirt cheap, all right? These things cost an entire set of resistance bands with handles and multiple colors and different um, tensions and the, the anchor that comes with the resistance. I mean, basically the whole set is, I don't know, maybe $25. And these things, there's just nothing to them. They're real light, okay? They're small, you can roll them up, and guess what that means? You can stick them in your suitcase. So guys, if you're traveling, okay, and you're, you're gonna be on, if you're a road warrior, and you're gonna be gone a lot in motels and hotels, just take these things with you, and you can get some fantastic workouts while you're traveling. And another thing it means is, if you don't have the time to go to a gym, if you don't wanna spend the money to go to a gym, or if you're just starting out, you're kind of a newbie and going to the gym seems kind of intimidating, this is a great way to start at home. You can still get ripped, you can still grow muscle, you can still boost your testosterone levels using the resistance bands as a way to basically tear down our muscles, because that's what we do when we're resisting, you know, when we're fighting against these resistance bands. We're creating millions and millions of little tiny microscopic tears in our muscle fibers. And then your body responds over the next few days by growing and repairing those tears, those damaged muscle fibers. They get repaired and your body is smart. It slightly overcompensates, okay? And so after a few days, you come back, that muscle is just a tiny bit bigger, okay? It's not a lot. But you do that day after day, week after week, month after month, your body slowly grows. And that is the key to getting ripped with resistance bands. So I've explained that the muscles don't know the difference when it comes to dumbbells or resistance bands or equipment at a gym or barbells or whatever. The thing is you, you need to know that you have to be able to hit every different muscle group in your body, okay? And that's a lot. That's like five different major muscle groups. We got our chest, our back, our shoulders, our arms, our legs, okay? How do you use these things to hit all those different muscle groups? I'm, and I mean hard and effective, all right? And it's not as obvious 
okay? All these exercises are not as obvious as being able to use dumbbells or barbells or going to the gym and using equipment. So that's what you need to learn. And I show you all kinds of cool little exercises and tricks on how to effectively use these resistance bands to target your muscle fibers, tear them down, and to truly grow them back bigger and stronger and ripped. So these things work fantastic. The trick is you gotta learn how to use them. And I've shot lots of other fantastic videos where I show you specific exercises that target individual muscle groups. So I want you to check those videos out. They are really fantastic. And guys, if you've never used these things before, I promise you're gonna get a fantastic workout you're gonna get tired, you're gonna get a great pump on, and then you'll realize how easy it is to get ripped using resistance bands. And remember guys, be sure and subscribe to this channel because we got tons of great videos coming out all the time, not just about working out, but we talk about nutrition, how to fix you know, sore backs and sore necks, it's all kinds of fantastic stuff. So if you don't subscribe, then you'll never know that we're coming out with these new videos almost on a daily basis. And then finally, hit that little like button, that little thumbs up arrow, share this video with some of your friends, post some comments below, because I really do want to hear from you. And finally, guys, got to remember, this doesn't happen overnight. So you have to stick with it and never give up on yourself.